Hey everyone, in this video we'll be learning about .NET MAUI image button. So here we'll be using the XAML language and here in the screen you can see uh, the image button whenever it's clicked then it will just display the uh, pop-up. So we'll be using the resources uh, folder where we'll be adding some images and uh, calling it inside our .NET MAUI image button control. So let's get started uh, to learn more about the image button in this video. This will be a very short uh, tutorial where we will be implementing the image button. So let's create a new .NET MAUI project and here we will be using the uh, .NET MAUI XAML language as our uh, primary language in order to implement this image button. But in our next tutorial we will be implementing the C sharp language too. So here you can see I have just given the project name and I have saved uh, it uh, anywhere as you like. But here I will just save it inside the uh, desktop where i'll have a folder named as maui tutorials then we'll just uh, create a new uh, brand new dotnet maui project all right so here you can see we have our main page.xaml we are going to remove all the source code of main page.xaml and uh, let's go to the main page.xaml.cs and let's remove this line of code too here you can see we have app.xaml.cs and here we are going to set our application to start from app cell which will encapsulate our main page.xaml so that's a normal thing inside our .NET MAUI project this is the exact place where we are going to bind our app cell with our main page to tell that okay we are going to set this main page as our starting page it's encapsulating by the app cell.xaml so here you can see I'm just setting my Android emulator as my startup project Let's run the .NET MAUI blank application on the Android emulator. So let's wait for some time. And then our emulator has been loaded. So this is just uh, uh, the .NET MAUI blank project. You can see here I can set the title of my uh, application to something like image button. So here you can see I have just typed uh, image button and uh, that's all. So here uh, the title has been nicely placed over here at the top of the title bar as well as the title view. Now here we'll be just uh, adding the one line of code that is our image button. Then uh, our whole image button um, control is going to be completed. That is like uh, we are going to take the image button with the image. So it can be placed inside the images folder of .NET MAUI said uh, images folder. So here we'll just take that image and put it inside over here. So we'll just type uh, .NET underscore bot, uh, dot SVG so that uh, we got uh, our, our SVG image. So we can just put the PNG image as extension too because it will take the first image and then uh, uh, the extensions are neglected by .NET MAUI too. So here we are just going to place the image to the center of the screen. So vertical option is center and expand. So and the horizontal height request I'll just give it to 140 so that it is visible to the screen and uh, now i'll just put some space and then uh, with request we can just give to so it depends upon you uh, and your requirement and uh, what you are going to use it over there and uh, let's put some image button clicked uh, handler over here so here i'll just type click and then here you can see uh, a nice little pop-up will come up that is going to tell that we can either use a new handler or the same handler that we have used so we can uh, use it as of our own so i'll just give the x name of this uh, image button as image button so here you can see i have just provided the name so if i create a new handler keeping that uh, x name then uh, uh, x name uh, extension uh, that is our new event handler will uh, be generated so uh, here i'm just using some breakpoint too so you can see at the line number 18 and 20 20 and i'll just stop the debugging and then here let's uh, get the event handler as a single await because we are going to generate some pop-up that will get generated whenever the image button is clicked so here i'm just trying to try uh, display a lot so we are just going to display some a lot and here uh, let's put some uh, text that is uh, the title and the message and then uh, let us give the uh, cancel string as ok so that we get a nice little pop up whenever that image button is clicked 
but so here i'm just going to restart the application and we'll just see uh, if it gives us correct output or not so whenever the miss button is clicked then uh, uh, here the uh, breakpoint is going to get hit whenever that button is clicked so let me just click that um, image button and then see so here i'm just clicking that button here you can see the breakpoint has hit and let me just maximize it and then step over to get the uh, button click so yes we got our as expected output that's all for this tutorial now thank you guys thanks for watching keep in touch for next tutorials